What's up, Raider Nation? Welcome back to The Domain. I'm joined by Kellen today. Yeah, sorry about that weird face. That's just how I feel by the fact that Simon is back in my home. Today, we're gonna start what may be a long journey to find the ODST Wombat Overwatch. Now, this is a very uh -huh. rare set. Apparently, Burlington's has a load of UNSC or ODST Wombat Overwatches, which That's, is super rare set. Is that coming from, like, Target? Now the Target's not carrying No, it, like... it's not coming from anything. Um, they just stock it? Have it, they always stocked it? They got it from somewhere we don't know I mean maybe I know a bit more than most people basically Burlington has a ton of these wombat overwatches and I'm gonna track some down and redistribute them back into the UK and apparently the price is mean apparently the price is really good it is one quite close to the house and then there's two so more so if I don't find it today tomorrow I'm gonna try again more mega let's get on this bike ride we got just a mild bit of rain on a nice Tuesday afternoon and a brand new bicycle that I picked up let's kick it let's find this Burlington First Burlington. Come on, wombats. Give me some wombats. Look at the size of this place. My hopes are fairly high, but I am still yet to see any evidence of a toy aisle, so... Fingers crossed, everybody. This definitely might be the biggest outlet store I've ever seen, but then again, America does always go large. Fortunately, a lot of the toys are trashed, like... Some of these are just empty boxes, but... Oh, <laughs> what do we have here? Hello there, Wombat Overwatch. How do you do? And a beautiful $7. We're definitely gonna keep that one. <laughs> right down there. Another $7 fine. And we get a hat trick. Can we get a triple kill? It says $12, but this is an empty box. At some point, this was a build and learn table. I guess we ain't learning and building an empty box. That's two Wombat Overwatches for $14. Burlington for the win. Baby. I had to come to Target to see if the rumors were true, to see if the horrible stories I've heard have actually come to reality. Oh my god, it's as the prophets foretold, no more Halo at Target. No Jazzwares either. There is a very healthy amount of Pokemon at least. That is a good sign. We just need to get Halo back. We have, oh. We've only gone and done it, boys. Wombat Overwatch. This retails for $22.7. Beautiful, beautiful. And a very hard to get set. So these will be redistributed in the UK to collectors who need them. It includes ODST Buck, uh, the squad leader of Alpha 9, the main protagonist in Halo 3 ODST. Am I gonna get to build one of these or are you gonna sell you them? You can build one. I mean, we can, you can, you can build one, dude. You wanna build, build one? You can build one, dude. I wanna do that. It's really cool. It's got the artwork from the original game so on it. So thank you very much for tuning in today. Hey, just kidding, guys. Look at the timestamp. You think the video is over? We got two more Burlingtons to hit, baby. <laughs> <laughs> At least one more. There's one in the city center, which I, it looks like a lovely bike ride. The to city center. I love the idea of like calling downtown Minneapolis the city center because it's not built like European cities. Hot take. It's what America's missing. <laughs> Strip malls I, I, are the death of, of, of everything. Yeah, absolutely. Like having like a general like city center. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's something we miss. Roll on day two. <laughs> Hey -o. Oh, that's a cool one. Yo, that's road trip ready. I think it's a bust. Shut out. Shut down. Oh, no. <laughs> well, everybody. <laughs> hey, guys, check your surroundings. Uh, looks like the second Burlington was a bust, but we did manage to still find the two wombats oh. from the first Burlington. And then I got a second or a third wombat from an Amazon sale for like some like 12, 15 bucks. The goodness of the ODST wombat ended up being better distributed than we thought. So go check out your local Burlingtons. Any closing remarks? Big Coat Factory guy. Bye everybody. See you next time.